It has been estimated that 10% of sulfur dioxide emissions come from international shipping. Working alongside with ships operator, the International Maritime Organization, HIMO, has introduced a mandatory requirement to reduce greenhouse emissions by using exhaust gas control system, EGCS, or scrubber system. Scrubber system can be used to remove particles and neutralize gaseous impurities from combustion exhaust gases, especially acid gases. The following are the location of the main equipment for scrubber system. Scrubber tower in panel side. Sea chest and process pumps are located inside the engine room low floor port side. During scrubber operation, Marine Growth Preventive System MGPS is in operation to protect scrubber piping and equipment from marine growth. During installation, take note of the direction of differential pressure type infometer for inlet and for distribution. Take note of the following. Flow direction of strainer. Suction and delivery side of process pump and rotation of motor. Flow direction of wiper check valve. Liners for process pump must be welded after adjustment of pumps and pipes. For process pumps and strainers, apply high tensile stud bolts and double nuts. For adjustable pipes, weld and apply coating after adjustment on site. During scrubber operation, sampling for seawater is pumped by water monitoring pump unit to water monitoring cabinet. It will measure pH, turbidity, pH, and temperature of seawater. Suction of seawater is from new sea chest. It will flow to strainer. To process pump, to wafer check valve, and goes to scrubber tower. Then sea water is pumped to scrubber tower. During the scrubbing process, soaks and harmful gases are neutralized and mixed with seawater. Clean exhaust gas passes through the exhaust duct to the atmosphere. Cleaning of exhaust gas is measured using the Continuous Emissions Monitoring System CEMS, and must be in compliance with IMO and ECA requirement. During installation of scrubber tower, be sure to read the maker's manual and maker's standard. Scrubber tower must have proper foundation to minimize vibration during operation. If none, install additional support. Exhaust gas pipes, temperature transmitters, must be insulated as per maker standard and shipyard standard. In order to prevent vibration and damage on expansion joints, 
apply pipe support as per maker's recommendation. Pressure instrument panels to be mounted just below highest tower inlet pipe as per maker's recommendation. After cleaning exhaust gas with seawater, it will drain to overboard. Be careful with jerry pipes insulation. Be sure that clamping pipes with linings are installed to prevent vibration and damage. In order to prevent damage on overboard distance piece, pipe thickness check, proper welding check, color check, and special painting check must be implemented. Overboard distal seawater is continuously monitored by Water Monitoring Unit, WMU, and must be in compliance with United States Coast Guard USCG requirement at pH 6. In summary, MGPS treated seawater are pumped from new sea chests. Dirt and seawater will be trapped on strainer to protect your process pump. It will flow to scrubber tower to clean the exhaust gas. Mix seawater and socks from exhaust gas will be drained to overboard. Exhaust Gas Cleaning System AGCS, will continue pumping, cleaning and discharging mixed seawater and sauce from exhaust gas. <music>